Well, the United Nations this week also expressed concern over the rise in sexual violence against women and children in South Sudan. UN Deputy Secretary General Amina Mohammed has met with President Salva Kiir during a visit to the country. She says the UN delegation has seen firsthand the challenges faced by those displaced by the nearly five-year-long conflict. At one clinic in Juba, in the past eight months, more than 1,300 women and children have sought treatment for injuries and trauma caused by sexual violence. What has been the worst part of the conflict in this country, um, and, and I think, uh, you know, here we, um, with the delegation, heard the pain and anguish of many women, and that's the gender-based violence, and in particular, the rape. And this rape doesn't stop at just women, it also includes children, um, to very, very young ages, as we heard, um, and, and that for us uh, is, has been abhorrent. It's, it's a horror uh, story when you hear it. Um, let's imagine when um, you have to go through that. Speaking to the women, seeing them with babies sitting in a camp in their own country is not a beautiful sight. You, as leaders of South Sudan, has got it in your control to give back to the women and the children of South Sudan their dignity and their human humanity. And I'm very confident that you will be able to do that.